Well, beware of the bed bugs. Indianapolis made the top 15 in Oregon's most treated cities in America for bed bugs. Not something to be too excited about, right? RTV6's Stephanie Wade is working for you to figure out what's behind that ranking and how to avoid catching the bug. I showed my uncle, I said, what is this? And he's like, man, that's a bed bug. A family is renovating their home, and when they were pulling up the carpet last night, they found a bed bug right here. I tried to stay calm about it, and I got up, and I think my girlfriend started crying a little bit. She got scared. This is what they kind of look like. They kind of got a red, brownish tint. That's when Caleb Diaz called this guy. This one right here is more of it. A technician with the bed bug company says unlike roaches or spiders, bed bugs can be pretty tricky to not only get rid of, but also to diagnose. Most people really don't catch them till they're adult or an adult female. And once you do have bed bugs, you might not know it. It could be on your shoes from being out in the library, from just being in a social event. Um, you could come home, they could hibernate down in the wood, and then, I mean, it could just wreak all havoc. He says he's not surprised that Indianapolis is the 11th most treated city in America. Trains coming in, major airport, you know, lots of commerce, lots of people living. Um, that's, that's all funneling into that. Because it is such a problem in the region, here is what to look out for. Kind of looked like someone took a pen and like they just kind of stabbed the pen on the edge of your bed or on your walls a thousand times. That's a telltale sign that you might also have some bed bugs. Another place you might find them are on wood headboards of your bed. Wood is a natural place for a bed bug itself to hibernate to hide. And if you do get bitten, this is some of the lesions of how some of the bites will actually look on a person. See a physician immediately. Stephanie Wade. RTV6. Oh, she, scrawly, uh, craw, creepy crawly there, right? To avoid getting bed bugs, Orkin suggests changing your bed sheets often, vacuuming around your bed often, and if you do get bed bugs, do not try to treat it yourself. Just call a professional.